Hi Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for tuning into your reading. This is going to be your reading your next 48 hours, you versus them. We'll see what's coming up on your side and also on your person's side as well. So um, look, before I get into the reading, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. That would be amazing. Um, if you did want to become a channel member, you will get access to member-only content um, uploaded to the channel. Um, otherwise, don't forget to drop a like if you enjoy this video. Um, really appreciate you being here. Let's get into this and see air signs. Let's look at your side first and then we'll look at them. Okay, let's look at you. Next 48 hours, what's going on on your end? Okay, Gemini, you've come up very strongly here. You're wanting communication. You want to talk. You want to reconnect with someone here. I feel like there's a situation you're being quite stubborn about um, or like you've made it in your, you've got it in your head so much that you want to walk away from a situation. Um, Eight of Cups, you might be walking away from cancer uh, or a water sign. You also have Taurus and Leo, so I'm wondering if um, a Taurus and Leo is involved here or you're walking away from one of these signs. So, okay, what I'm getting is, is that you are feeling distraught or hurt or disconnected about something here. It's a love situation and you feel like there's been some distance. I definitely feel like you are in an energy where you want to bring something closer together. Like you might be sort of checking in with your person, but it might not be as much communication as you're wanting. You are wanting more as of this energy right now. So I feel like some of you, if you're not going to get it, it's like you've got to hurt yourself and leave and walk away this, from the situation. So I definitely feel like you're connected to this person. You obviously care. I don't think you want to leave, um, but I'm seeing that if you're not getting the results that you're wanting, um, if, you're, if they're not going to offer up this relationship or if they're not going to be monogamous or whatever you want from them, um, you're powerful enough to walk away Okay, from the situation entirely. Um, some of you will just maybe entirely turn your back, turn your back on love. You've got you know, walking away from Venus energy. So it might be sort of putting you off relationships entirely or someone's energy, excuse me, is putting is putting you off entirely. I do feel like some of you are like, I, I get like you're done. You're done with a person. You're done with a situation. Um, something has happened here. You've been in the dark. So it may be like you feel someone's being secretive about you. Like um, they're not introducing you to any of your family or friends. Like you meet at very secretive little spots. You don't feel like you're out loud and proud. Um, and that's concerning. That's making you overthink. Um, that's making you overthink the situation, I feel, um, from what I'm seeing here, air signs. But I do feel like some of you have to walk away from a situation right now because the timing might be off. I reckon that it's timing, um, but for you, it's like you have this idea of what you want and like maybe it's a kind of relationship that's really open or it's a kind of relationship where you put each other on your statuses and put up photos of each other. Maybe it's a relationship where you travel or you settle down. Like it's a type of connection that you want and you've seen other people want it. Like maybe your close friends have it. And you're like, okay, I think I'm ready to have that now. Or I think I'm ready to have that again. Like it's activating within you a kind of energy because you're wanting love. You're wanting the lover's card. You're wanting your, to find your true love. You're wanting the, um, you're wanting this person to sweep you off your feet and you're not settling for anything less. You're in a power play position with the Leo strength energy, which is good. Um, which I feel like you, you have options in this situation. Hmm. Okay, strong Libra coming through. So those of you that are dealing with Libra and this person's coming in. Um, we also have, okay, Eight of Cups, Five of Swords. There might be someone here who's dealing with another person or another connection. Okay, they might be talking to another person. They might be involved in this sort of lover's triangle, but I think they're trying to cut this person out or they will cut this person out. They're not entirely single. The Hermit card is reversed. So I get that this person is possibly distracted by multiple connections, air signs. It can be a Virgo. It can be a Libra. Um, they may be sort of 
Yeah. Okay. There may be two timing. Five of Swords, third party situation here. They may be talking to someone else, maybe not seeing them, maybe not dating. Uh, maybe they've never been with them like physically. Maybe it's an online thing. Um, but there's definitely someone else here they're speaking to um, that's causing maybe some confusion on their side. So you want to talk about something they don't, they're not ready to talk. Uh, not just yet. It's almost like they're not, they're not sure what to say. And the hermit is reversed. The king of swords is communication eventually though. So I do feel like they are going to open up, but it's not going to be to the depth that you want air signs. They're not going to really tell you why they did everything the way they did, what's going on internally, what's sort of like the heaviness of this situation. They're not going to be like fully detailed. So don't expect all these wonderful details and this really like this super big DNM, like deep and meaningful conversation. It may not happen because they may not be ready. Um, I do feel like they do want to cut ties with the Five of Swords situation because it's exhausting for them. Maybe that's why they're not giving you what you want and then you're wanting to leave. Or it's like some of you, you may give this person an ultimatum. You're like, if you don't stop talking to other people or if we're not exclusive, then like I'm done here. I've got nothing left to offer you. Um, this relationship is done for. And it might just scare this person into losing you. Because suddenly when that happens, the world card is reversed. Their vision, they're not thinking clearly. So I feel like their their head's a little bit all over the place. Um and it could be like drama from a different relationship entirely. Um, but I feel like there's an ultimatum that may come from your side. And I think they're going to choose you. Okay, if this is a choice, I feel like they'll choose you. Because on your side, sorry, on their side, you're coming up as the king of swords, um, as the justice. So you're coming up as someone that's given the ultimatum. And you're coming up as someone that's not really tolerating any BS. It's like, it's either we're together, we're good, we're loyal, let's have fun, let's do this. Or, you know, if you want to see what other people are like if you think better opportunities are going to come along let them do it at signs um let them explore that with the world card if they think they can find someone else or they think they're better suited to someone else let it be sometimes the universe wants us to realize these things um i know it's a hard situation to be in but you will come out of it stronger and you will know because there, i feel like there is an energy here where this person can't be alone they can't be single they may have some insecurities you will speak and reconnect but i feel like there is something about them having to respond to your ultimatum or what you've sort of put out there for them okay they need to respond they need to sort of now um maneuver their way in the situation to make you happy because they might have done some things that have made you unhappy okay hurt um pained unsure you know you feel like you want to leave you want to turn your back on love this person has some proving um to do to you i feel so it'll be interesting to see how that plays out but i'm gonna leave it there thank you again um air signs for tuning in and hopefully we'll be in touch very soon so thanks again and bye for now